So, if you guys have watched literally any of my gameplays, you would know why I'm super excited for this one. We have now got the Galaxy Opal Jonathan Isaac. So, he came out in the out of position two packs. Basically, once you completed the whole set, you were able to get Jonathan Isaac when you lock it all in. And it is actually a pretty expensive set because all the players don't really go for too much. But then there's this point guard, Kevin Durant, that goes for like 2 million MT almost. Yeah, 1.5 million MT. Pretty expensive. But then you're able to lock it in. And as I said, getting Jonathan Isaac is a big win because for me personally there's one thing I like in this game and I don't even have to say it I'm not going to say it because it's beautiful the thing about this Jonathan Isaac is he's just the perfect card for the way I play and you guys ready for the stats so he's six foot ten at point guard and small forward 99 on both offense and defense I do have a diamond shoe on him but just look at this like 92 driving layout 95 three ball 95 standing 97 driving dunk 94 ball handling good passing and he's known as a lockdown defender in the league and I tell you what his stats do not disappoint. Like he's got great block, great steal, great perimeter to defense. Really good rebounding too. I put the shoe on him to try and give him speed with ball. So he's got that at 98 now. 97 lateral quickness, like really good mental stats, except for the shot IQ. Great dunking tendencies as well. And then 54 Hall of Fame badges to go with it. I don't even have to go over these, but he has all the ones you want on a point guard being Dimer, Rim Protector, Clamps, Interceptor, which is a big one, Range Extender, Rebound Chaser, Quick Draw, just to name a few. Like every single badge that you one on a point guard, as I said, is on this card and he's looking so nice. And not to mention when we have a look at the team, I did actually sell my GOAT Magic Johnson just because I realized when I lock in this set, I'm going to get two point guards because now we have Kevin Durant off the bench as well. And he's also six foot 10 and you kind of get this card when you get Jonathan Isaac. So it's a bit of a win. But yeah, this is the squad. I'm so excited because I feel like if you're going to watch any YouTuber, any gameplay on Jonathan Isaac, mine's probably going to be the one that you want to watch. And that's not me being up myself or anything. I just love the player style, the body shape of this man. That sounded kind of sus, but I'm here for it. <laughs> also, this set was so expensive to complete. I literally spent like 2 million MT on this because I tried to do it as quick as possible. So if you guys could please smash that like button. Let's see if we're able to get to 3,000 likes on this video. We don't usually get that many on gameplays, but I believe in you all. Anyway, we are now 6-0. It doesn't really matter if we win or lose, but I want to see what Jonathan Isaac can do. So without further ado, let's get into the first game. And here we go. We found our first opponent. His team isn't good at all. We're about to have a field day. And yo, let's see how we're able to go straight away. Can we win the tip with Kareem? Yes, we do. Kicking it back to Jonathan Isaac on the first play. I'm going the snatch back. Let's not pull that. Probably could have pulled that with Larry Bird, but let's take it on the inside. Jonathan Isaac going up, missing that. Not a great start. Are you guys ready? With this card, I actually turn off my meter. He's so good without it. We got a steal this time, so we're good. looking okay. We're looking okay, and I feel like you guys are going to hear me get a lot of steals, and there's the three for the green. We literally play perfect defense, and look who pulls down the bit rebound. It's a Larry Bird. This is another green. I'm telling you. Yeah, Michael Jordan Jordan gets us to steal this time. Let's stop, pop, get the two. It's a terrible release. It's still in. The thing that this man is six foot ten, and he looks bigger than six foot ten on the court. I just love it so much. Let's pull another three, bro. Like I'm terrible without meter in this game, but this is my favorite card to use without the meter because I green everything. You know I haven't even scored inside with him yet. We've just been pulling threes and greening every single shot. Let's kick this one out to MJ. He is kind of double teaming me now. I don't know if he's even playing to be honest. Yeah, he's got 18 points for us so far. Definitely not too bad. Make that. 20. I'm sorry, Kobe. And then we finally got an inbound steal. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. Oh, wow. It's not what I wanted, but it's fine. It's going to work out because we can go the hop step, kick it back out. This is a green. You ready? Yep. I told you. Yes, yeah, so we got another steal and we've got a sharpshoot take. So I'm just going to stop, pop, get the three with another green. What a rebound there. That's that Hall of Fame rebound chase. And we've already got 26 points with him. Let's not pull that. Let's kick it back to him this time on the outside. And then we're going to go probably for on the inside. Let's just take it with him this time. Sharp shooting take. I'm sorry, DSJ. And already after the first quarter, that's the rage quit. So what a first game it was by Jonathan Isaac. I'm telling you without meter, this card is perfect. And that's me saying that. Like I never run without meter, but this card, oh my. So anyway, we're definitely going to get into another game. We haven't even tried our bench yet. Obviously we are now seven and zero. So let's get this other win. Without further ado, let's get to it. Please give me a good team this time. Yes, we are. Let's go. So yes, we're going against Yard a point guard and I'm actually really happy to see that because I want to show you what I can do with this card and I feel like this Giannis is definitely a great opponent to go against right now we're in my zone so don't be surprised if that happens without my defensive settings that's what I mean like is that just me who feels that who feels like you never get dunks when you run without meter I don't know but 
That's what I'm talking about. Anyway, it's time to go to the line with him and let's see if we can green these. No, but definitely not bad getting one assist, one point, and one rebound. Make that two. Yes, yeah, so we got a steal this time. I'm kicking it back to him. Let's get the snatch back. Let's pull his three. It's a green. No, it isn't. What? Okay, it's still in. All right, let's run it up. Let's run it up. Let's kick it to him this time. We have to dunk this one or else, yeah, I'm turning my meter back on. Give me that. Yes, we finally got a steal with him. That's what I'm talking about. Bad dribble moves by your boy, but we got to kick it back. Then go up with Jonathan Isaac, two points. Also, I think over in America, you guys say like Jonathan Isaac or something. In Australia, we say Jonathan Isaac. So that's the reason why you might think my pronunciation is a bit weird. I see comments all the time. And my opponent really hasn't been taking the best shots so far, but he's been making them. So it's been a little bit disappointing. Let's just hold square and get the dunk. I really am just trying to bait him into getting a steal so badly. Now, this should be one. Yes, we get one with him against Larry Bird take it all the way with another dunk. I can't believe it, but right now it's actually Bob Pettit who's destroying me on the rebounds, which is kind of annoying, but let's maybe, oh, I should have taken that. I really should have taken that shot. Probably could have taken that one too, but again, we're just going to drive free throws. And at least this time you can see his actual bar for the release. It's money. His free throw is definitely very nice. Yeah, we got another steal there. Let's take it on the inside this time. That's tough, but at least we got the steal. 17 points to him in the first quarter so far. I'm not complaining with that. Let's take the little mid range. That's a great shot. Give me that. Oh, that should have been a steal. It's backcourt though. I wonder how many times in this game I'm going to say, give me that. Let's stop, pop, get this three. And there it is with the meter. All right. I feel like what I can do here is I can dribble up with MJ and then kick it to Jonathan Isaac. Just stop. Let's kick it here. Not a great pass, but it might work out because he's just way too big. Take it in on D-Wade. Take it in on Corey Maggetti. Get the little post hook. I like it. I really just want more scores with him now though. And this is going to be two more points. Give me that. Yeah, we got the steal this time with MJ. And I'm going to kick it back to Jonathan Isaac. Stop, pop, it's deep, but that's another three. Get that out. What? Bro, you're kidding me. You're kidding me. Luckily, you did actually miss a free throw. You don't see that too often, but I swear you see it all the time when they miss, when they get three. That's all. Oh, that is so close to being a steal. Okay. And that right there just shows you as to why I love him. Just because he can actually usually get those. What a nice drill move for another three. And we're up by five right now. I do have my bench on the floor. So hopefully we can make that a bit more. Let's go down here. And we should be able to kick it out. Unfortunately, he didn't really go to the spot that I wanted him to. But the little hook again, two points. All right, all right, all right. I'm feeling a bit confident now. I'm feeling like we're playing quite a bit better, especially on the offensive end. And this is just going to be easy too. Literally on the defensive end, the reason he's scoring so much is because I'm trying to bait him into the steals so bad. I'm telling you, we green everything. Yeah, we got a steal this time with Thonmaker, and guess who the one player out is? It is Jonathan Isaac. Give me that. Oh, that so should have been a steal. Okay, well, that's fine. That's a terrible shot, and you guys see, my boy has takeover, so it's big moves because we can kick it here. Stop, pop, get that three. Give me that. That's a steal. No way we don't get that one. Okay, well, we should get it with D-Wade this time. That's what I'm talking about for point number 50, Jonathan Isaac, baby. I think it's just the recovery that he's able to make on most defensive possessions is just like A+. Plus. And at the start of the second half, he has 53 points and has continued to take his takeover back into this half. I don't understand. But yeah, this is basically a Ben Simmons with better defense, like better length in my opinion. And also he's a lot better shooter. Like you can see, I green everything. And I get if he's tired right now because I've literally just been holding turbo the whole time with him. So I feel kind of bad because, you know, he's kind of dying on the floor, but the thing is, he just doesn't miss, except for right now, fine. We are still only up by 13, so we're not we're not playing like the most insane, but at least it's gonna be 16 now with that three. And I just came off calling pretty much all my timeouts. Giannis is on us now, but it's just not good enough. I think one thing that might actually kill this dude is when I go into my hybrid defense. I'm feeling it, I'm feeling it, or I'm also feeling the dunks. So yeah, I came off calling pretty much all my timeouts, which is very nice because now we have almost full energy with Isaac, and that's free throws for point number 70. There it is. Maybe we just add two more here. I'm just holding square. There's a jam right there. All right, all right. Let me, let me, let me say one thing. We're not really playing the best right now. It's a five point game, but luckily we get the hop set for the two. There we go. We get a steal with MJ this time. I was kind of feeling a bit bad, feeling like I was playing terrible, but that's a big play. I don't think I've ever seen another dude green so many shots with the meter on. That's not me if I'm keeping it real. But point number 80, there it is. Yo, here we go once again against Giannis. That is just an easy two points. Oh my word. I can't believe we're losing. We're literally down by two, but it's fine because we're going to even that up now. Let's lock in. I'm not going to go for an inbound steal here and we're just going to play good defense. I'm showing you this now. Let's try and get to Corey Maggetti this time and he does actually kick it to him. That's not a great shot and it is going to miss. Finally, we get a rebound too. Let's kick it to Jonathan Isaac. Hold square. Take it all the way and miss that. What? Okay, well, he kind of got his own rebound. He helped out on the boards at least. Let's pass it back to him. Kick it back out. You can see he's blinking with energy right now, but it's fine. 
because we can take it to the right. Go the hop step this time. Going up, there's the dunk. Yes, sir. And we get another steal. I'm just gonna take the dunk on this one. I wow, that's a layup. Okay. Oh, that's a steal. Oh my word, that was a crazy steal too, especially for the situation. He misses the shot. Okay. Then we get the steal this time with Thon Maker. This is a GG. This is a GG. There it is. Finally, he missed a three. Oh my, it's taken a very, very long time. And he's kind of double teaming me now. Good dime back, but we want to still score with Jonathan Isaac. So let's hold square this time. More free throws. This is easily one of the most high scoring games I've ever played. And we get another steal this time. This is tough, but... Okay, we're still only up by six. So I just got to make sure we actually score on every possession. And that's going to be two more there. If you guys want to know a big reason as to why it's over right now, it's because we have, we have sharpshooting takeover, which just means... That's actually a good shot. Oh, that should be a steal. Oh my, he actually got to that. That's point 100. He missed a wide open three. It's a crazy sight. It's a crazy sight. You know what else is a crazy sight? Let's kick it back to Anthony Davis. Not really the greatest of passes, but point 103. I find this crazy because I'm not lying when I say my opponent is definitely a good player. Let's go to the flashy dunk. What a windmill. Oh, that could be another one. Wow, we were so close to that. We do end up getting it with Dwayne Wade. And now I'm just going to kick it back. Stop. Let's run around and let us just pull the moving shot three. Everything's green. It's one of the two but still and just like that we are gonna end up winning this game by 14 points and i was super happy with one man's performance because jonathan isaac in 20 minutes had 107 points you heard me correctly two rebounds one assist nine steals which is crazy only two turnovers and look at the shooting percentage though 39 of 60 that's good but then the three point percentage is just absolutely crazy who would expect jonathan isaac to literally have probably my favorite release in the game one of them it probably goes d wade and then base 98 and then jonathan isaac as my top three but what a game this was. And yeah, when I said my opponent shot well, look at that, 26 of 39 from three. That's what kept him in it. But yeah, we had 37 points off turnovers, so that helped too. And just like that, we are now 8-0. And, and uh, is there a player I have to thank? Obviously, it's Jonathan Isaac. That was just a crazy gameplay. Like, you guys saw how often I greened with him. His release is perfect. Now, the question is, do I recommend this card? I'm going to say yes. It's only if you think you're going to use KD as well. If you can guarantee you're going to use KD for like the rest of the year, then yes, I do recommend him. For the way I play, I have to get him. And if you play like me, get a lot of steals and need a lot of length, then yes, he is worth it. But yeah, that's pretty much the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to smash that like button. As I said, 3,000 likes on this video would mean a lot. And yeah, thank you all for watching. Smash that like button. Subscribe if you can follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram. And I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye.